if I have to record this video one more time, I swear I'm just going to fuck. Literally my third time recording this video, bro. Every single time. My face cam does not want to be in sync. I don't know. I'm just going to say if it's not in sync in this one, oh well. Out of sync video because I'm not recording for a fourth fucking time. Holy. Literally going to be repeating myself for the third fucking time. It's actually ridiculous. This kid literally has the word try on in his name and I'm already intimidated. I feel like I'm going to have to fucking sweat my entire fucking ball sack off. There goes me in, in the recommended section already saying fuck 30 million fucking times. You want to know what really sucks about my situation right now? While me recording the same video three whole times? It's not because I have to record it three whole times. It's because I actually played pretty decent while recording for once in my life. Usually I'll be a god when I'm not recording and or streaming and then as soon as I and then as soon as the capture card turns on I just turn into shit. But for once in my life I actually did okay while recording. I, I had some nice shots you know and uh I didn't die too much and overall for just a simple discussion video it was pretty interesting. But nope here I am already down on the ground where I belong and fucking dead like my entire hopes and dreams. So everything we've seen so far i i really like it actually i'm not disappointed with what we've seen with gears 5 so far i know there's a lot of people who are disappointed a lot of people that also are not disappointed a lot of people that don't care and just want the game to come out already I'm like a little bit of both. I liked it, but I also just want the game to come out already. There was a lot of people complaining about there not being campaign gameplay, but if I'm being honest, I'd rather not see gameplay to begin with. That's just me. And the reason being is that, uh, I'm sorry, Coalition, but literally every single time you guys have been at E3 and you guys showed gameplay, the player you guys chose, I don't know who you chose, but whoever it was, is literally a fucking trash can. Just saying. And I don't know why people are barely just noticing in the comment section. They have chose, they have chosen trash cans for literally every single event. They showed gameplay gameplay of a new gears with i'm not even joking i also had trouble seeing why people didn't like the inverted omen at all until i actually paid attention to the omen in this game like it's actually night and day i mean like i'm down for change like i like like i'm like whatever it's fine but literally the omen we have now there's actually nothing wrong with it at all you can see which direction you're shot from where you can see like which direction you're shot from with it you can literally see everything like there's no vision blocked and then with the, and then with the inverted omen, you literally can only see like in like in the middle of your screen. But if I'm being honest, holy fuck, why am I getting triple teamed? That is so fucking ridiculous. You're fucking kidding, you piece of shit. The omen we have now allows us to have the perfect amount of vision while still being aware of how much health we have. I don't see why the inverted omen is actually a thing, but I also don't mind it. If it's actually a problem in game, then yeah, I'll stand with everybody in like complaining. But uh, for, for right now, I could honestly care less. I also don't know why people think that the escape movement is going to be the same as the movement in multiplayer. That is actually not the case. There's no way that it's not going to be. And you can really tell because if you ever play Horde ever in your life, the movement's also different in there compared to here. So like, there's actually no way that we're getting the same movement in escape than we are in multiplayer. It's actually impossible. I'm also extremely okay with the reticles we have, honestly. The, the reticles are actually great in my opinion. I'm down with those. I feel like I, feel like I could be more accurate those reticles than I can with the ones that we have now and I don't know why. The national one didn't change at all which is also great, thank god. If the national one changed then we would have had a problem because the national uh, reticle is actually perfect. Why am I getting double teamed? I also don't see why people were so against the beard or no beard Marcus or why that was a whole fucking problem. Literally it is a beard. I don't care if he has it or not. Make him fucking bald for all I care. Holy. Great. More fucking double team. Trash. Fucking trap! Toxic Nasher one by day also did pretty well, in my opinion. Could have been better, but you know, it did it didn't do terrible. Got around like 20 people from for majority of the stream watching, and that's more than I usually get, so you know, thank you guys. I, I'm not really sure if it matters or not to you guys, but I am gonna stay on alternate for an actual long time. I know I, I would usually switch, but I think I made up my mind finally. I believe I am just better at alternate. I just feel like I'm more composed, and I hit more of my shots, and I just don't roll. And it's just an overall more fun experience because it's something new to me. I've been playing default thumbs for literally my whole life and so playing uh alternate thumbs is actually a little bit different it's fun for those of you who are wondering how i play thumbs and alternate um it's actually not as hard as you guys think so i play i play tournament alternate but it doesn't end there um i go into button mapping and uh i configure my a to y and my x to a and my y to x so that i'm able to run with the a button and pick up ammo with the x button and my y button becomes tacom and so if you're wanting to switch to alternate on thumbs that is just the way to go don't listen to any other all player honestly because other 
where our players are used to all they've been playing all their whole life but they don't know what like what it was like to change from thumbs to like you know to alt thumbs so take it from someone who actually knows that experience i may not be like the best alt bouncer but i definitely know the change in like what's comfortable for me and of course everyone's different so what's comfortable for me may not be comfortable for you but i do recommend trying uh, trying out my method if you want to switch to alternate on still be on thumbs i don't know about you guys but i for one thing gears of war 5 is going to be the actual best gears and i believe that a lot of great things are going to happen for a lot of people and i really hope that i'm one of those people uh, you're fucking kidding oh, take that you fuck i'm gonna join avenge i'm gonna join avenge i'm gonna join avenge you're actually joking when my teammate came through yo good shit teammate oh no, no you fucking didn't you liar i think what I want more for Gears 5, more than popularity, is longevity. I hope this game lasts, like, literally for a long time, like Gears 3 did. Like, I want I want Gears 5 to be my next CSGO, because I'm still playing CSGO, and that shit came out in, like, 2012. So, like, I hope Gears 5 can just last, a, like, a long-ass time. Okay, buddy. Yeah, you're so fucking good, Whitney Moon. Where's Whitney, Wisconsin at? I gotta fucking bag him and then end the video. Fucking trash can, you piece of shit. You're actually so fucking ass, bro. Holy shit. I'm not even sure this video's that long. I, I literally, the video would be like, I'm telling you, the first one was actually just the greatest recording. I, I lost my train of thought recording it for the third time, so I'm sure this video's all over the place in garbage, but I'm uploading it anyway because I honestly don't care.